What's going on, YouTube? The Independent Stacker coming to you again tonight, May 14th, 2019. As of 9.45 Eastern Standard Time this evening, gold is down very slightly at 12.99.36. Silver is down 2 cents at 14.88, giving us a ratio of 87.33. We've seen some winners and losers on the big board today, but all of our gains and losses have been very tiny until we get to the top of the board. Let's take a look. Platinum is down slightly at 863.15. Palladium is up $10 at 1340.35. We saw small gains on both copper and aluminum today, and we saw a decent gain on a barrel of crude oil currently at 61.56. Our biggest gains of the day of note are the Dow Jones and the NASDAQ. We saw some rallies going on today. The Dow Jones closed up just over 200 points at 25,532.05. And the NASDAQ rallied 90 points at 77,34.49. On the currency conversions today, the euro is down slightly at 1,121.00. The Canadian dollar also down slightly at 1,346. The British pound down slightly as well at 1,291. But we saw a decent gain on the Aussie dollar currently at 1,442. Tonight is our 50th episode. Spectacular fireworks and confetti. Woohoo! Guys, this has been a great journey so far. And I can't is express enough to everybody that watches and supports my channel, my videos, uh, just how much it really appreciate. Uh, I really appreciate it and how much it means to me. Uh, when I started stacking uh, this journey, the stacking journey back at the beginning of the year, I had no idea what I was doing. And quite honestly, well, I'm still learning. I think we're all still learning. And that's what this community is really all about is is stackers helping other stackers become better stackers. And that's what is, is so awesome with this community, guys. Everybody helping everybody else become the best stacker that they can. And guys, I can't tell you uh, enough. I really do appreciate it. From the bottom of my heart, this is just the greatest network of of people. And, and I don't want to even say people. I want to say friends that uh, that we could have. Uh, so guys, I really do appreciate it immensely. I can't imagine, I couldn't imagine six months ago that I would have a, my own YouTube channel. I've got, I think, 231 subscribers now, which is a drop in the bucket. Uh, but, you know, that's a lot of subscribers. I got people worldwide that watch my videos. That's just an amazing thing. The internet is a crazy place. And, uh, you know, guys, keep on stacking everybody support everybody it's just really important that we keep getting the word out and supporting everybody's channels and making everybody more educated with stacking silver and other precious metals and one person that i think uh, uh, most of us can probably agree uh is a big driver in our community in helping us become better educated is tonight's Big stacker shout out, Salivate Metal. That's right, Uncle Sal, Salivate Metal. He is uh, a great uh, influence in our community. I think he's closing in on 22,000 uh, subscribers on his channel. Uh, he is putting out content every single day. And that content is, is invaluable, guys. It is... Uh, if, uh, if there's one channel that you guys can watch that's an easy channel to watch that really breaks it down and puts it into that bite-sized form that you can just pick up your phone, watch 10 minutes of YouTube, that's the 10 minutes that I want you guys to watch is Salivate Metal. I'm going to post a link down below to his channel just in case you guys are not familiar with him. I might have a few viewers that are new that uh, are not aware of Salivate Metals channel, so make sure you check out that link below. But uh, I think we can all agree, Salivate Metal, Uncle Sal, Salavate, he is uh, just a great guy, great channel. And sir, 
we do greatly appreciate everything that you do for us. Let's jump into what we're adding to the stack tonight. I've got two coins for you guys. These are both 2018 coins, but they are very, very different. First one I want to show you is one that I picked up at a local coin shop here in the last few days. This is a 2018 Canadian Maple Leaf. Now this one is obviously different than the other Canadian Maple Leaf I have, the 2016. But uh, this is my first actual Canadian Maple Leaf that I have in my stack. We will go ahead and flip this over. <gasps> it's the Queen! England. We had her on the program last night as well, but uh, yeah, Ms. Elizabeth the second coming on back. Just gonna do another episode. Well, this one's kind of kind of grody, but uh, you know, it's bullion. Let's face it, it's just bullion, guys. Um, I'm starting to warm up to the fact that it is just bullion. Um, we're going to get to just bullion in just a second, but uh, on the next coin, you guys can really have fun uh, picking me apart on the next one, but uh, just a really cool coin. I uh, had never seen one up close until I actually bought this. Uh, the local coin shops here in my area just do not have any of these. I was, what I was really surprised with, and you kind of see it here on the left side of the video, um, these really micro fine lines that are that are radiating out from the center of the coin. Um, that just doesn't pick up when you're just viewing pictures of it. It's just really cool. I mean, it's a very cool uh, anti-counterfeit measure that they have on their coins. Um, yeah, I mean, well, I don't know what else to say. But, uh, I know a lot of guys, especially here in North America, really like these uh, as an alternative to the American Silver Eagle. Uh, so... Yeah, just a really cool coin. I'm glad I uh, finally got to add one to the stack. The other coin tonight is a 2018 South Africa Cougarand. This one is a first day of issue MS-70 from PCGS. And before you guys chastise me about this purchase uh i will go ahead and say i did not purchase this this is actually one that uh my father purchased a uh pcgs uh package of 10 of these i'm not going to tell you what he paid for them but i got mine for free he did give me give me one uh from from his purchase uh we opened it up over the weekend and uh uh it's pretty cool uh, and again, this is another one I had never seen up close until I actually got one. So one thing I noticed about the tin that he got in the PCS, uh, PCGS package was three out of the 10, uh, had milk spots on them. So I want to know, have you guys experienced milk spots on these? I know we've talked about milk spots, uh, and milk spotting here in the community in the past. And, uh, it's really the first time I'd seen some heavy milk spots on any coins. So let me know down in the comments below what you guys um, know about the milk spots. Does it bother you? Uh, does it affect the quality or condition of the coin uh, long term? Be interesting to see. This kind of reminds me an awful lot of myself before I cut my beard off. Uh, nice long beard. Chin strap beard, long hair, slicked back, yeah, big nose, big bags under his eyes. Yeah, this is what I look at every day in the mirror. <laughs> it's a really cool coin. It's nice to be able to add one to the stack. So, so what do you guys think? Uh, let me know down in the comments below. And, of course, if you guys enjoy tonight's video, please consider smashing that like button over here. And I always appreciate those subs and bing bong, jingle jingle bell notifications so you can keep up to date when I put out these videos. The Independent Stacker is here once again to remind you that if the women don't find you handsome, they should at least find your pockets heavy.